Hey everybody, Zach here at eTrailer.com and today we're going to be talking about a replacement part for the Rolla TX series bike rack and that's the straps. So right here I have a brand new bike rack in place. There's nothing wrong with this one but the TX style bike rack has been around for a while so whether you have the two, the three or the four bike sometimes those parts get worn out and you need to replace them. And the most common one that we see are these straps. So they're just a thick rubber strap and after a while, if they've been exposed to the elements, the sun, or just after a lot of use, they get a little brittle. Sometimes they get stretched out or they break. So what we can do is we can replace that. So today I have a set of replacement straps if we needed to replace it. And I'm gonna show you how to swap these out. So the first thing we need to do is remove one of our cradles. So we're just gonna pretend that this top tube strap is broken. And I'm going to take a Phillips screwdriver and I'm gonna loosen this cradle up and take it off. So we'll just get this loosened up and we can slide this off. Try to get this loosened up enough to where I can just slide it off or I don't have to completely remove it, but it's looking like I need to take it all the way off and pry that out. So not a big deal, but we'll get this taken out of the way. Try not to lose all the parts there. Get that pried out a little bit so we can get that. And you know what, I gotta replace this as well down here. So we'll get this taken out of the way. I'm gonna put it in this position right here. Unscrew this right here. This is to keep our cradles from sliding off. And this bike rack is going to be a really good one. I, I'm sure you're familiar with it if you've used it enough to where you've broken or they've worn out, but I like that Rolla has so many different replacement parts for this bike rack. So, you know, if we've damaged something else, we can get those swapped out as well. So they have cradles and the anti-sway cradle, a lot of different things to get this bike rack so we can keep this working for us for a long time. So we'll slide this cradle off and you can see this will just slide off and then I'll show you the new one. These are going to be identical. Now this one has been in storage so it's not been used. It's been in that position for a while but you can see they're going to be identical to one another. So it's the same exact strap. We just slide that back on and we can repeat that same process to get this back in place. Well, when you put your cradle back on, you want this hook to be on the outside. I originally started putting that on backwards and we'll get that put in place. Get this screw back on there so we don't have those falling off. And then if you're replacing any of your other parts, it's gonna be kind of the same process. You'll wanna remove this screw here to get those cradles off if you're replacing cradles or the anti-sway. So really you just need a Phillips screwdriver, which is really nice. Cause that nut on the backside can sit down in that little groove and hold itself in place while you tighten this up. You can see we've got a strap on there again. So the other one wasn't damaged, but that just gives you a better idea as to how you can swap those out. So. You have one of these get damaged, it's a pretty quick fix. I did it under five minutes. If you had any others, it's a really affordable way to keep your bike rack lasting for a few more years. And you know, if you have any other issues, we definitely have those parts available, but that's gonna do it for our look at the Rolla replacement straps for the TX series bike rack.